there's actually a lot of uh, misinformation about who John Scully was and and his role at Apple. Um, while he was the CEO, there uh, Apple had a board and Apple had uh, venture capitalists that that had invested millions of dollars in the company, and so. Um, John Scully is kind of famously known as the man who fired Steve Jobs from the company that he created. But in fact, uh, John Scully didn't fire Steve Jobs. Steve, Steve Jobs was fired by the board and by the, the people who, who were investing in, in, in Apple, um, which is very sad. I, I had the pleasure of meeting John Scully, and um, he's very, still very troubled by uh, the, the whole uh, everything surrounding his relationship with Apple because it ended so abruptly. When I heard that he was playing this part, I thought, what a fantastic opportunity for a young actor like Ashton to uh, be really uh, pushed to uh, an area of creating a character, uh, a characterization of, of, a, of a person that everybody knows so much about. Um, just like we do Ashton, you know, that they kind of mirrored one another, that they, there's was so much we know about Ashton because of the paparazzis and TMZs of the world. So I thought this was, they, they mirrored one another in a way. And I thought that Ashton, this, this was gonna be a great opportunity for Ashton to prove himself. And, uh, and from the, the, the time that I've spent with him on this film, I think he's doing a remarkable job. John Scully brought to Apple an unbelievable understanding of uh, how to sell something, to sell an idea. That it wasn't it wasn't computers that they were selling. It was it was what people can do with a computer, you know. And and that is limitless because never people will never stop imagining that they can do something more with their lives. You know that that a, the computer is just a tool.